I hope that idiot that put a bunch of down votes in the fucking chat right now feels like a fucking cuck piece of shit. Man. Fucking yeah, it, it, don't vote this shit. shit, man. Boo. Don't vote this Boo. shit, man. Don't vote it. We got to wait. Oh, wait. Here, they, oh, they're starting right now. Oh, man. Oh, it's a good thing there's no fucking accountability for the stupid shit that I just said in the chat. So what happens is um, whenever I do, whenever I go on Discord and actually talk to people on Discord as I do with my uh, Discord hangouts that I do as part of my Patreon, for some reason it fucks up voice meter settings and we didn't realize that. But now we do. And uh, that's just kind of how it goes. That's just kind of how the fuck it goes, you pieces of shit. Sorry about the, the no sound version. We've already deleted it. Kind of sucks. Man, we should have left that up, dude. That's like a lost episode. We had some of the funniest interactions oh, we've man. ever had. If you guys that's... only could have heard it. Yeah, I mean, if you only could have heard, we how try funny to recreate we were. it, but we just can't. I mean, there's no point in trying. There's no point. You still don't have audio. Oh, well, Justin G doesn't have. All right, well, close yeah, it back yeah, down. Yeah, all right. Let's let's uh, just close it yeah, again. Sorry, right. guys. Cancel. Hey, I guess. I, mean, I, I don't know why I apologize. You can't hear me, so. Mm. Good old Justin. Re no sound. You know what? People used to enjoy watching silent films back in the day, and now people are just spoiled. They want everything to have sound. Yeah. You know. I want do the uh, all eleven of you undo your down votes, please. Undo your goddamn down votes. Can we rewind those down votes, please? No, they just added another one. <sighs> Boo. Boo. Rewind those goddamn down votes, you piece of shit. Boo. Boo, I say. Boo. I can, I, I'm looking right at the screen. I can see there's no <laughs> lag. I can see there's no drop frames. <laughs> I have things that tell me when that happens, believe it or not. <laughs> we just don't have things that tell us that there's no audio. You I, know mean, what I mean, that's a, we that's... do. If, I'm, if I was looking at that the whole time, I'd have realized, like, oh, uh oh, doesn't seem like we're putting any sound out right now. Anyway. You can hear me, but you can't see me. Good. That's because he's John Cena. That's because you're blind, bitch. Sound is completely overrated, especially <laughs> when it's just us talking. It's not like it matters. Uh, anyway, why do we even need image in our films? Bunch of spoilt brats. Damn right, Philip. Finally, a person in the chat with sense. <laughs> Dude, my, my plan worked. I tripled the down votes. <laughs> yeah. Brilliant. <laughs> What's about his fucking down vote, guys? Yeah, fuck him. <laughs> <laughs> he says not to down vote it. I will down vote it. Assholes. Why does our why does our cynical movie channel draw an audience of just cynical assholes? I don't know. It's so strange. I don't get you it. Never fucking figure. Um, so are you ready to come right in this movie's ass? Uh, <laughs> I don't know about that. Yeah. I'd like to take it to dinner first. Are you ready to fucking blow a huge load right up this movie's supple, perfectly formed asshole, Paul? Sure. Let's That's what I'm asking you. This yeah. is called Death Stalker 2. Yeah. It's from 1987. I've never even heard of Death Stalker 1, let alone 2. And uh, I guess that uh, it was a Roger Corman uh, yep. joint. So. Roger Corman joint. So definitely going to be like a Conan ripoff from start to finish. Cool. All right. So is this the Black Panther? Yes, this is the Black Panther review. This also oh. takes place in Wakanda back when white people were allowed in. Yep. So let's take a little gander. <laughs> Promising start. Spooky castle. <laughs> That castle is like B-roll footage that's used in so many bad horror movies. I don't think so, dude. Oh, it is. Dude. Pretty sure that's a unique castle created specifically for this film. By the way, there are tits in this. I will try to turn it off when the tits appear, but... Oh, yeah. there are? Yeah. Damn. All kind of tit is up in this motherfucker, uh -huh. But, whatever. If a tit slips through, so be it. So be tit. All right, so we're starting with a little Indiana Jones ripoff here. That's cool. At least this dude has some personality to his face and shit, you know what I mean? Yeah, I mean, like, he's better than the average B-movie actor already. Wow, his sword skills are fucking amazing. They're abysmal. They're, he's he's only better than the two retards that are running at him. 
Maybe that's how he gets by. Dude, I've seen LARPers do better sword shit than this. Yeah, dude. I wish I could download a second time. You can. Yeah, I mean, create another account. It's not that hard. Oh my god. Whoa. I got so fucking lightheaded. Uh, all right. Okay. Dude, this fight scene so, is dog shit. Uh, it looks like um, it looks know, like a show that you'd go see at at, at like a uh, one of those fucking theme parks we were at. Yeah. The, the Check out the Deathstalker Two Island Adventure over at Universal Studios. <laughs> Whoa. They should have opened with that. All right, is it those titties that we see? I don't know. Those those two big old fur-covered sweater kittens that we just saw? Maybe. Because if so, I don't want you to skip them. I, I want to go ahead and risk it. I mean, you'll still be able to see. I want to risk it for the biscuit. Deathstalker 2. Wait, what? She just said death? I well, mean, I think she said I want to like two, some like, oh, like T.O. Right, okay. right, yeah, yeah, yeah. But, uh, you know. Yeah, yeah, I get it. Wink, nudge, nudge. Death Saga 2, starring John Turkle, Monique Gabrielle. Gabrielle? John Laser. I think that's our main guy, dude. John Lazar. John Laser. Tony, Tony Nipples. Nipples. Yeah. Sweet. A bunch of porn actress names. Can't make his name funny. Go away. Note to self, do not use fire for a credit sequence if I ever make a movie, because it's super annoying after about a second. <laughs> Dude, if, uh, fucking... If, uh... <laughs> whatever. <laughs> if, uh... <laughs> If uh, TJ slamming his axe on his desk like a spastic is more impressive than this movie's sword playing. Cool. Uh, dude, yeah, the edgelords in this audience are going to know a lot about sword play, too. That's true, because you know they all got sword collections oh, yeah. and shit. Definitely. Let me go! Let me go! Quiet, or you'll eat steel for dinner. Looks like you Yum. everything else. Shut up. Oh, oh right. shit, fat this joke. It's about time for a fat joke. I am not a beggar. I'm a seer. Even the king knows that. All too well, girl. You're like that bitch wouldn't be begging wife. for shit. Yeah, it looks like a hooker. The only thing she's begging for is dick. Kingdom, a man would delight to learn Damn. his wife would soon be child. I think this on is PG-13. I saw a scene of a guy sucking a chick's nipples for like a minute. <laughs> so <laughs> I'm pretty sure it's not. How's an oracle supposed to make a living? The king Dude, a, a minute worth. How's of an nipples? oracle supposed to make a living? You Shouldn't like you be able to like predict that? Yeah. Right, right. And I'm Merlin the magician. Yeah. I'll be off with you, princess of beggars. Be Death sorry. Stalker You're still sounds less sorry. stupid than Let's Killmonger. I agree. That's a, a fair point. Only by a notch or two, but <laughs> at least Killmonger wasn't the title of the movie, though. <laughs> Who the hell are you? I'm Death Stalker. Dude, who's feathering his hair for? I don't know. I was just wondering that. Hey, Tommy. What's up, brah? Oh, shit. It's Tommy from the Bronx. Tommy from the Bronx loves this movie. He recommended this. Village idiot the two runners up. Oh! Shit. Oh, no. Not dirt. <laughs> wow. It's a pretty shitty sword. Which Oscar did this win? Um, all of them? Yeah, dude. The Swamp Ape guy finally tweeted back. He said Swamp Ape 2 has a script but no budget. Also, look into Horror Express sometime. No, we don't want it to have a script. No. We, 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 we need to have this. He needs to shit can that script yeah. and fucking go with our superior storyline. Yep. Then we will fucking procure him his budget. Swamp Ape 2. Swamp Ape rapes Manhattan. Yeah.
Let's see. Whoa. Well, I've already failed, so whatever. Yeah, I guess there's just gonna be titties. <clears throat> oh my god. There's a lot of them. Gratuitous titties. Well, I like that guy. He just walks by like, Whoa. huh. <laughs> titties, eh? <laughs> Whoa. <laughs> Any, literally anyone that gets them every that. time? Putting your hand through the, <laughs> through the candle? Yeah, dude. Ladies can't resist that. Holy shit. Got the pig monsters and all that shit. No, I got a nice big room upstairs. Cool. What do you say? The three of us go up Oh, there. man. I can't I whistle. Need to talk to you. Life, you gotta help there we go. Me. One rescue a day. That's my policy. It's a matter of life and death. Do the words walk east till your head floats mean anything to you? Hey, you walk princess. east till your I head floats? You no, they honestly job. don't. I guess like walk east till you're bobbing in the ocean. Okay. All right, another terrific action sequence. Man. It's just gonna be one after the next. I mean, can we go back to the bitches shaking their titties around and shit? So far, that's all I would have kept in the movie. Come on, ladies. Okay. So. So he's just destroying the place now? He's just like, <laughs> like <laughs> my issue is now with this bar. Yeah, dude, this, somebody said this soundtrack is on point. Whoever's on the Fife is really ripping it, dude. Paul and TJ, do you like the band Slayer? Yeah, in fact, that's them playing right now. Yeah, it's Slayer on the Fife. <laughs> Didn't know uh, they could play that. Damn, don't throw shit at the bitch with the titties out. They seem pretty used to it. They're just like, yeah, you just jiggle your tits, and then if something flies at you, you duck, and then you stand up and you jiggle your tits some more. Uh, I'm guessing this place devolves into this at least once or twice a night, then. Yeah, I mean, that's why the tables are all so shoddy, because they're just like, eh. Oh, dude, he tried to punch Iron Gut McGinty in the stomach. Yeah, you can't do that. That guy's too Iron tough. Iron Gut McGinty's never been fucking doubled over by a punch to the stomach. Yeah, do something useful. Why is she the only one not embroiled in Mortal Kombat? Even that bottle was barely enough. Yeah. All right. If Luckily, you give, he's if not you give him the two-fisted yeah. fucking upward swing punch, that's he what is does not him. Iron Balls McGinty. That is his cousin. <laughs> Loving these tits. Yes, chat. Yes. I mean, come on. Like, <laughs> <laughs> they're all right, but do you really got to come to us to see tits in a tiny little, like, small aspect ratio screen in the bottom right? You know what I mean? Apparently they do. Because I got a thing for you. Like, after you're done with this, go to Google and type in tits. That sounds cool. Yeah. You'll be surprised. I've never tried that. You'll be surprised at what you find when you, when you type in tits. Who's fighting who? I don't know. That whole thing just devolved. I don't even remember what the original fight was about, do you? Um, some guy slapped that bitch for no particular reason. Oh. And then he started. And he white knighted. Yeah. And destroyed the whole goddamn bar. Yep. I'm Why doesn't she pull her shirt off so her titties are out the whole movie? She's the main character, dude. She don't have what? time to put her tits out. Well, that's that's my thing. Is like, just because she's the main character, what does that mean? She her titties shouldn't be bobbling around like every other broad. Because her movie. titties should be up to the imagination. See, that's that's what that's where these fucking uh, you know B movie guys fall off. You know what I mean? They got the right idea with the gratuitous violence and the gratuitous sexual content. That's just not enough. They don't they don't realize that that's all we're coming for. So they try and like fill in all these other little action sequences, like shit like this. Cut it and put a scene with some titties shaking around. How much do you think the director got laid in and around the set because of this movie? Probably I mean, that's zero. probably. I mean, I don't know who directed it. This is a low budget film. I mean, it's a Roger Corman oh, joint. I mean, but I don't know every who directed. every girl who you just saw oh, naked like was definitely fish fucked fish by fish someone involved oh, with the production the to get the role. You think? Oh, yeah. That's how, that's how Hollywood worked at the time, up until this Me Too shit. Bring back old Hollywood. 
I don't mind telling you, lady, people in these parts consider me quite a hero. Oh, you're a hero. Yeah. All right, you know don't act. Me? Just can't say that I have. All right, so I, I've figured out the hierarchy of this movie, se this movie's scenes. You gotta get up pretty early Acting morning, scenes are down things. here. <laughs> Fighting scenes are like marginally it above that, and then the titties. Morning. Yeah, titties. And that's how the movie works. She has noble titties. It uh, operates on those principles. That's true, I guess. You never do get to see noble titty. Yeah, those titties are too important to be glanced upon by the peasant class. Is Harvey Weinstein behind this? He was behind a couple of the chicks in this, probably. <laughs> Harvey Weinstein is awesome. Yeah. I think we finally lost him. All right, maybe you'll see your tits now. I'm starving here. I guess Just not. Never second. mind. Haven't had a thing to eat since Whoa. last night at the boots. That looks like a bowl of mud with bones in it. <coughs> that doesn't look good. You cannot cook well. Here, try it. It's my specialty. Shitty oh, it's analysis, enough. TJ. Why? Like it? What sort of insightful thing mm. should I be saying Whoop. right now? Very good. Late again, TJW. Getting tired of your dragon pew all down with your tardiness. Pew all? Pew all. Thank you. That was great. Great. I apologize. Oh, you must have really been yeah, hungry. quit dragging me down, TJ. More? Quit putting me down oh, in the no. muck. Couldn't eat another bite. Couldn't I'm another. sorry. I know I kind of messed things up for you before. <laughs> well, a chick that looks like this doesn't have to cook. Why does. She wasn't she being a bitch to him before? Now but she's being nice, and now she needs something. Now she needs his help with some I shit. Tell you oh. no, really. Yeah, tell his future. It's a I predict you will never be in another film again. Your destiny. Something tells me I don't really want to know. I don't know. I think Everyone this guy got a bum rap, destiny. man. He's got a certain he's charisma. You know? Okay. 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 Sure. Okay. Things can't get much worse, I guess. Shoot. <laughs> I don't know. Spirits of tomorrow. Hear my call. Now she's completely fucking nothing. Spirit of tomorrow. I see you embarking on a heroic quest. It shall become legend. And storytellers oh. shall Oh, she's got one of those expensive things from Spencer's. Well, I sure hope they get my name right. The crystal golf ball of power. Yes, I see it so clear. $39.99 at Spencer's right there. No. And that's without the lighted base. If you want the lighted base, another fifteen ninety nine on top of that. To Damn. Help me, help me, desk stalker. Only you can save me. The great desktop piece, though, for a oh, you know, like a power trouble. desk, you know. A matter of life or Conversation death. piece. <gasps> what? I see someone else, dark and evil. With big this tits. Bad. This is real bad. The princess is being imprisoned by Jarek, an evil sorcerer. Evil kind? sorcerer. I love her He's read on that line. An evil sorcerer. Yeah, you can tell she was probably coached into that. She was probably Wait. saying, Jarek, an evil He's sorcerer. And they were like, you really gotta oh, drive home how evil he is. Evil. Evil, evil sorcerer. Well, that's, that's, I guess that's evil. better. I guess we'll keep that take. <laughs> Good enough. <laughs> Next. Oh, no one's gonna watch this shit journey. anyway. Many dangers. Witches. Dragons. This reminds me of Star Wars. In the sense that it's also a movie, I guess, I don't know. And reap a fabulous reward. The all nine never lies. And this is going to get me into the legend. Right up there with Conan. Wow. Wow. Brazen. Ballsy. Brazen. Ball. Oh, wow. Sorry. You all right? I kind of yes. felt bad about what being about preoccupied with tits watching this movie, but this movie clearly wants well, me to be, so... I'm out of here. It's well, yeah. Where are you going? It's it, it it only exists to show you titties. I'm not getting any younger, you know. Go. I I realized Does earlier when I was now? talking about how like B movie it, producers don't get it. Wait they should just do well, all titties. They they have figured that out. It's called porn. Still yeah. Soup. This was I think this must have been like for guys who were like I want to see a legitimate ah! movie, but in all they really wanted was titties. So why just, can't we combine those two? Yeah. Just make a story like this, right, where she's on the run, and somewhere at Next. the very beginning, as she's escaping, somebody rips her fucking bra and shirt off. 
Perfect and she just got nothing up there. For she the whole goddamn far. movie, the titties are out. Bobbling around when she's riding horses. Every time, she, you know, she tries occasionally to cover them up, but it just always backfires. Yeah, that'd be a great little subplot. She, You know, they, they stumble into a raided village or something. She finds a blanket, and then some goblin comes and snatches it. <laughs> you know what I mean? Turns out it's a cursed blanket that just makes her tits bigger. Yeah. I created you from the original soul of the princess. An exact duplicate in all respects. Unfortunately, I haven't had time to work Dude, on I feel like I know this guy from something. <clears throat> in other words, yeah, I don't know. If she dies, Doesn't he seem like familiar? You die. Kinda. But once I've made a few minor adjustments in the formula, I can duplicate yeah. anyone, then eliminate the original. Now, my dear, please run along. These brief practice sessions are the only leisure I allow myself. And I enjoy them so much more. Alone. I mean, I'll be okay. in the chamber, waiting. As you wish, yeah. my dear. Go As wait you in wish. your chamber, bitch. Next. I got sword oh. things to do. Sultana. Damn. You know how I hate standing in line. You look marvelous. Lovely as a rose. You'll find I still have my thorns, too. It would devastate me if you hadn't. <clears throat> Tell me, what do I owe the unexpected pleasure of your company to? This guy's got it pretty good, man. He's got a hot blonde bitch. He's got a hot brunette bitch. After what you've done to me, I Kills dudes for fun. Yeah, he's what a good I mean, villain. He's you know, got it going on, man. Never would have been able to I'm telling you. blonde bitch of yours up on the throne without my help, let alone get rid of the real one. You were paid handsomely. Quite handsomely, I might add, for your services. It distresses me that you will not let the matter rest. You swore that I'd rule by your side. I did not come here to bicker with you, Jerak, my dear. I have a proposition for you. Okay. Oh, and you're willing to let bygones be bygones, is that it? Well, let's just say that I'm willing to forgive and remember. You wish to have the Princess Evie return to oh. you. I wish to settle a Unlike forgive and forget, I, I say. Escorting her back here. I again offer you my services. In return for the pleasure of disposing of him myself. I have a man shadowing them now. Doubtless you'll remember Chin the Buccaneer. Chin, wow. The this movie is introducing more characters amateur. than I could possibly <laughs> care about. Yeah. And you he remember Jerry the accountant? <laughs> He's there now, <laughs> running the numbers. <laughs> Deathstalker? Oh, very well. He's yours. You remember Enjoy. old boulder flinging Death. Billy? He's up there on the mountain getting ready to Always fling a boulder as I speak. Likewise, Damn. I'm sure. Next. Why would the why would anyone Oh well whatever. Oh, oh shit, Look there's gonna the be a cat, cat fight. Well, if it isn't the royal slut herself. I In the unrated version, does she way. just start blowing him? Yes. <laughs> yeah, probably. Oh, and I must thank you for Hopefully in this version these know. chicks tear each other's bras off. Hopefully on. they're gonna do that right do. now. Come on, well, yeah, that's I what I'm saying. And I don't share my men. <laughs> if you're speaking of Jerak, he wouldn't want you now that he has me. I really ought to mess you up. But I yeah. can't find it in my heart to give you the pleasure. If you had a heart, it would be black. I suggest. Oh my God! Damn. Out of my way. The barbs these chicks are trading are straight up the lamest barbs Did I've ever. Did Shakespeare heard. write this or what? <laughs> like horrible. Show yourself out, Sultana. Scissoring incoming. I know Gladly. you are, but what am I, bitch? Also, like, how is it a fucking even a slight for one villain to call another villain black-hearted? Like, isn't that kind of the point? We're all evil here. Whatever. I guess you know. She's lawful evil. And, and the other one's chaotic evil. So they don't get along. Yeah. What's racist? The fact that there's not been a single person of color in this movie? This is what Wakanda was like before fucking T'Challa took over, dude. Looks pretty lame. <laughs> yeah. I'm glad they blacked it up. Yeah. Although actually these characters might Which be a little bit more Almighty richly Oracle? developed than T'Challa was. Why do they call you the Prince of Thieves? They do? Because I'm the best. But you're not a real prince. No, not exactly. Um... If you had the chance to marry a real princess, would you do it? No, I wouldn't. Why not? Because being a princess brings out the worst in a woman. They whine and pout and... 
Just that's, isn't like that just women? Yeah, I was gonna say. What do you mean? <laughs> like every woman I've ever dated has not been a princess and has had those qualities. Damn, <clears throat> sexist. There are four of these fucking films. Cool. According to zeros. Which way? The West Road. Thanks for your sure. contribution. The zeros. So there's four Death Stalker films. Are they all this good? Yeah, man. They all have just like titties bobbling everywhere, and hopefully by the fourth one, they've just turned Deathstalker into a pair of tits. <laughs> just an armored pair of tits with a sword between them. Yeah, <laughs> bouncing around, killing people. All right, it's time for the mud wrestling match. Yeah, I love these bars and these types of movies, man. I want to go to one so bad. Yeah, like how come we can't? Where do I go to the bar where slave women have to wrestle in mud? Yeah, and there's just like ale flowing and dwarves walking around. Yeah, fucking crazy shit Could everywhere. I naked get bitches. Some of that in real life, please. You can just pick a brought up and spin them around and tackle them and rape them. You know? Like, yeah, get your ass down here, bitch. This is actually one of Harvey Weinstein's parties. <laughs> He's uh he's presiding all over, over all of this in his throne somewhere. Dead stalkers as good as in the grave. Look, sailor, don't carve a tombstone. The dry so ice lately. budget is he phenomenal. Has many lives as a cat. And remember, <coughs> the last one belongs to me. The bikini budget is off the charts. Three and four are PG thirteen. Well this one ain't. Yeah, yeah, this one's decidedly hard R. Just for the titties alone. If he's made of flesh and blood. Man, I want to go to one of these Never medieval bars in the worst way. Yeah. You're immoral for even wanting that, Paul. Just, like, dude. These women are the being exploited. that's going on there. It's like everybody's just pissed, fucking fighting drunk. There's naked bitches everywhere. I mean, God, man. There's pig men going like that. I've never been to a bar. There's super villainesses talking to dudes with eye patches yeah. at the fucking counter. All kinds of intrigue and sex and rock and roll and fucking metal going on, dude. Say hello to crazy There's that guy. The I'd just Solely give him a wide berth. <laughs> yeah, I don't think I'd be coming too close. <laughs> he ain't what I'm here for. I'm sure you recognize Ed the Hedge Shamansky. That the guy seems all right, though. Wow, they're, they're, they're doing what I said. Next, John the Baptist Bombasso. Drowning the John, station okay. Beside him, Nick the Crippler what, of Cat. What Catholic. time in history is this movie supposed to be taking place in? Because, I don't know. The real fine, buddy Footstool the Rosa. Only recently dismissed by Ivan the Terrible for excessive brutality. So this is during the time of Ivan the Terrible, I guess? Still okay. skeptical? Um, you bet I, I think he came a little later than this time in history, but okay. Yourself. Come on, boys. No, don't send him away. I want to see all those different assassins try and kill the Deathstalker one by one. Especially the midget. Okay, man. Yeah. Let him have it. Dude, it'd be great if the midget just did kill Deathstalker. <laughs> and he awesome. was just the hero of the movie, and they just lavish praise and Close rewards man, on him and kill, shit. Not yet. Wow. Some explosions. Exploding arrows. Cool. Yay, explosions. Wow, they're pretty impressive. This really does. Every action scene in this movie really does look like a fucking stunt show you'd see at a theme park. I'm telling you, dude. I think they just got some cinematic cameras and filmed one of those. Put we, some titties in it. We'd like to adapt your your stunt show into a movie. It's not long enough, though. Ah, we'll just fill the rest with tits. This movie is not gratuitous enough. Five dollars now, five more after Segmento comes out. It will please me. Whoa. Well, I think right. we better find I another mean, way. That oh, really? seems fair. So? West Road, right. Oh I no, Segmento. Who are they? You tell me, you're the Thank seer. you for your We're five dollars. Thank you for freeing Somebody me from this gibbering gone. fool, sweaty, smelly, disgusting shirt. What is this stupid no, film? I, my intellect demands a much higher bar than this film can produce. Whoa. Whoa. 
Okay, fair enough. You and your visions. Segmento is a snob. Come in handy. Yeah, he doesn't like shitty movies. Just Poor Segmento. I want to help. So Done repressed. All right, you got your fucking shit. Give me the other five dollars, or I'm gonna sue you, Camp Counselor Steve. Yeah. <laughs> You That'll will be, be fine, sued. Boys. You better Save make you better make good on your fucking shit, dude. Well, Travis Heimbaugh is on to something. He says, "Hey, this movie isn't very good." <laughs> Whoa! I don't. I never realized. You know, now that I'm thinking about it, <laughs> I think he might be right. Yeah, slit his fucking throat, Deathstalker. Wow, he's really violent. I know. <laughs> I didn't really take him for the type of guy that would. Yeah, he just, just sneaks up behind you and slits your fucking throat. You don't give a, a shit. Slit a dude's fucking throat open, but whatever. Whoa! Whoa! <laughs> that midget exploded. Damn. Damn, Deathstalker! I had such high hopes for that midget, dude. <laughs> I'm glad he went out the way he did. That was awesome. All right, yeah. The shoes. His little, his, his little, little midget, midget shoes, shoes just sitting there smoking. Wow. <laughs> I wish I could watch that over and over and over again. <laughs> oh my! Oh well, that's not too bad. That's kind of a downgrade for a kill. That exploding midget was the best thing I've seen all Stop week, him. man. Uh, a lot of people are saying Stop they actually it. killed that midget for that effect. Because back then, that was before... What? Yeah, it was back before midgets had rights. Oh, man. Back in 19... Yeah. Well, no, I mean, to our sensibilities now, oh, right. obviously, killing a midget is verboten. But, you know, at this time, Segmento is Christ. You've earned this like a cheap whore. Thank you. Well, there you go. Thank you for making good... And watch the view count plummet. Why would the view count plummet? We're watching one of the greatest films ever made. Yeah. Huh? All right, slit her throat. Throw yeah, keep... throat down, or I'll cut her pretty little throat. Segmento. Oh, oh yeah. yeah. I already spread that. You rat! <laughs> oh, oh. You were gonna let him kill me. What? No! He just said. What is your you, fucking you problem, you retard? No! It was a subterfuge, oh. you dumb bitch! And, uh, would you mind taking that knife out of that guy for me? It's the only one I got left. Oh. Oh. Alright, I'm I'm ready for her to die. Were you really gonna yeah, she you? sucks. I'm ready for her to but die with her tits out. She's a lot like the uh, chick in um what was that? Temple of Doom? No, Red Sonia. Or wait, no, not Red Sonia. Um, fucking. Ah, what, what was the one where the, the little spot. princess follows him around in the Hall of Mirrors and all that you shit? Oh, uh, Conan movie. Conan, yeah, the I'm Destroyer. Right yeah, the Destroyer. There you go. She's similarly annoying. You just don't understand cinema, Paul. Whoa. What news have you? Bad news, Lord Jarek. I hate bad news. That thing at HBO? Yeah, they invented day. Skype. I got an idea. <laughs> it's like wizards. It's like <laughs> cauldron Skype. I'll kill that son of a bitch if it kills me. You may wish um, that it will. Okay. All right. <laughs> uh, whoa. I guess he's dead. Whoa. It's like... A Man, I portal? wish I could do that through the internet. Yeah, dude, fuck yeah. Do you know how many people- I'd be a serial killer. <laughs> yeah, me too. There are so oh, many man. people who I'd just kill. Well. Okay. Ah, <laughs> 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 uh, this movie. Whatever. Hey, look, it's a Halloween store. Yeah. Yeah, looks like somebody's front yard at Halloween. Yeah, that's what I'm saying. I still don't understand why you want to break in there. Because we're broke, that's why. What's that got to do with anything? That's a family mausoleum. There are probably more jewels in there than we could carry out. You're about to become a very rich woman. 
I was just starting to enjoy poverty. Come on, where's your sense of adventure? Really? This is an adventure. It's just damn scary. Yeah, but uh, when this is an adventure, it's, it's just damn racist. scary. All right, this chick just has this chick blew every single fucking person on this production. I mean, to get this role, there's no way. This is just a symbol of male privilege. The fact that a woman has reduced to this role, you know, just annoying fucking no nothing empty bubble headed idiot. Yeah, it's really she just her talents are incredible. So I can't believe they consigned her to this. Yeah. I don't. Oh, yeah. I was just beginning to enjoy poverty. The main character is JF. Um, why? Because, I mean, he hasn't fucked her yet. Yeah. When he fucks her, then you could say he's JF. And he's not chain fucking bitches all up, the, up and down the East Coast. Or if you see him lick her legs, then you know. Yeah. That's how you know a JF. Look, relax, will ya? The leg licking is a dead giveaway. Dead giveaway. Well, come on in. What are you waiting for? Oh, come on. It's a little smelly, but what could happen? I don't know. Probably something like that. All right. So then she dies, right? Yeah, dude. I hope a bunch of zombies oh, come girl. up out of the grave and just fucking gang rape her. I've seen porn actors better than this chick. Well, I'm check out her follow-up movie because I'm pretty sure yeah. that it was probably porn. Deep throat debutantes or some shit. Yeah. I feel like... Oh, yeah, Tor John. Yeah, it does kind of feel like Plan 9 at this point, doesn't it? Where was that torch hiding? I don't, oh, wow. You know... Uh, But I believe it carries a rather stiff penalty in these parts. Who the hell are you? Forgive me for not introducing myself properly, but I assumed a person with even your limited... Looks kind of like Neil Breen. Guest. Yeah, he does. Maybe this is Neil Breen before he got old. This was how he started. Stalker! Yeah, dude, I'm gonna get what I wanted. Bunch of fucking zombies. Let's Are go, they rape boys. zombies? These though. dudes were literally buried like a quarter of an inch deep. <laughs> like, I mean, they were lazy in these times. Paul. <laughs> that, that cannot be a good way to cover. People up a were board. dying every other fucking day. You know, there must be no wind in this place. Fapping. What fapping? And I can oh, give her a way, stiff a penalty. Well. <laughs> <laughs> Pretty sure they're the, all the same dude with different wigs on. Okay. Oh, the old crushing wall routine, huh? You couldn't do better than this? Let me guess, there's a twist. Oh, there's spikes. Okay. I mean, I've seen that too, but whatever. Why don't you run, bitch? She sucks. He's stuck behind that thing. He's not gonna come save you, so... Run away. She's fucking terrible, man. I mean, they're all... They're... Okay, whatever. Just die. Have fun. Gotta be a secret lever around here someplace. And they really are just ripping uh -huh. off Indiana Jones as well. As much as they can... Is he gonna have to reach in a hole filled with bugs to pull the lever? Maybe it'll be full, filled with tits. Zombies are pretty cool. Okay. Yeah, climb the spikes. Okay. This trap was pretty poorly conceived. Seems like you could fit through that. Sweet. Why are the ones behind her not grabbing her? Yeah. Zombies are all filled with worms. You know what I've always wanted to see in a movie? What? 
a zombie that was like had like a beehive in his fucking chest, and there was like oh, yeah. bees coming Leave out and shit. Minutes. That'd be cool. Come on. Somebody that just died out in the woods. Yeah, you know, and a bee fucking, you know. Yeah. I don't know. That'd be pretty sweet. I'd like to see it. Beehive zombie. What is that? Was that the target audience for this movie? Uh, Death Stalker 2. Uh. <laughs> Dropping us some frames. Try lowering the bit rate a little bit, huh? <laughs> Maybe not die, hell. Uh, looks like it was a temporary thing, anyway. Sometime knowing that doubt bet rat help out, though. You know, these fuckers will complain till the end of time if there's even the slightest lag ever. <laughs> Bang. Whoa. <laughs> right. That'll soften him up for the princess. <laughs> Whoa, why does that guy have the voice of Dr. Girlfriend from the Venture Brothers? Who knows? That is softening him up. Alright. This movie has a good amount of midgets in it. Yeah. That one's especially creepy looking, too. <laughs> yeah, I know. Good That's on pretty cool. You know, it's a shame that we live in... <laughs> PC times where you can't have you uh, what is that instrument called? That's not Don't a ukulele. Not what is <laughs> loot. Yeah, I'm, we need more loot here. playing midgets with creepy faces and funny hats, serenading big titted women sitting in creepy. <laughs> Look at him. <laughs> Whoa. It's happening again. Oh no, I'm disappearing and then reappearing through jump Guards. cutting. Guards. I like all the fucking creepy faces on the bed behind her. That's a pretty cool bed fucking frame. They got going. So what I understand is, is that that bitch is a clone of the real princess. Right. And she looks exactly like the bitch that's with Deathstalker. Right, because she's the princess. Right, yeah, yeah, yeah. And that's her fucking evil stand-in bitch. That's, right, she's you know, going to have to kill her. Controlled by the guy who right. looks like Neil Breen. And she's going to eat this fucker's soul or whatever. Wow. Maintain her form. She likes twinks. I mean, even though this guy's got to realize it's a trap, I mean... Can I say this? She's way better as the evil bitch than she is as the as the, as the real bitch. Yeah, you're Am right. I wrong? Maybe it's because in real life she's evil. Yeah. That's closer to how she is in real life, just like a vamping sex maniac. Yeah. Makes sense to me. Wow, there's a lot of this movie left. <laughs> yeah, I mean that performance was better than anything she's done as the I mean, good chick. still fucking horrible beyond reason. Yeah, funny. But yes. much better than this. Yeah. First we get attacked by bandits. And then those damn zombies. What's next? Don't answer that. Every time it's like they're waiting for us. This Jarrett guy is playing for keeps. I told you the path would be filled with perils. Yeah, yeah. We can forget the legend if you want to. There's still time to turn back. Reward's still up for grabs, isn't it? Uh-huh. Who said anything about turning back? <coughs> Let me guess. His reward is he gets to be the king. His reward is he gets to fucking titty fucker. What are you gonna use? His reward oh, is he gets to be the fucking is. ruler with her. She's the reward. Maybe, uh, sure. maybe she offers him a seven up. Here's your reward. A crisp, refreshing seven up. A bag of peanuts. Oh, okay. A half-eaten bag of Doritos. Wow. Are they going to bone down? That twink didn't have a lot of blood like most twinks. Wow, we got an experienced twink murderer in the chat, I guess. Good to know. So this bitch just like she eats twinks? That's how she sustained like the evil clone? Uh, we got numerous people in here claiming to drink twink blood, so... Dude, that's a good way to get AIDS. Yeah, don't be drinking twink <laughs> blood, dog. You don't want to go anywhere near twink blood. 
All right. Is this almost over? Uh, we're not even to the middle. Just follow the road to Baggett. See, here you go. This, uh, we're at 40 minutes in, and it's an hour and 28 minutes long. So maybe we're, we're pretty close to half. Yeah. So I was wrong. But, uh, yeah, not quite half yet, though. No surprises. No surprises. No surprises. No surprises. Oh, man, what a cut. Whoa. So we've been kidnapped by Amazons or something. I don't know. Fucking A, dude. <laughs> There's just like a tribe of supermodels living out in the fucking wilderness. <clears throat> yes. Let me do the talking. They obviously appreciate men here. Maybe you haven't heard of me. Silence. Haven't we met before? No, 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 no. I don't think so. I would have remembered. You look a lot like Evie of Jafir, the demon princess who raids our camps and burns our crops and steals our men. Me? A princess? <laughs> wow. No. <laughs> what a meta bad we performance. <laughs> It's like oh, yeah. she's a bad yeah, actress right. trying to be a bad actress oh, in a oh, scene. Well. Maybe okay. I made a mistake. Yeah. Uh, well, <laughs> now that we've uh, cleared up this little misunderstanding and we're, and we're all friends again. Bongs, uh, blunts, or miniature blunts in bongs. Um, the girl may go. I'm going to go with blunts. Nice. I'm going to go with yes, please. Yeah, yes, just please. yes for Paul. So you, you have heard of me. <laughs> oh, yes. Your legend proceeds. People are always asking me what my preference is for that type of shit. I'm just like, whatever. See, I like joints. I don't really have one. Like, I like joints. I like pipes. I like bongs. I like, you just like weed. I like blunts. I like uh, dabs. I like, you know. Do not insult Army of Darkness by comparing it to this shit. Whoa. All right. Great. Damn. How's it going? Deathstalker has so far, got a bod. Yeah. That's the spirit. Come on, come on, let's get He going. ain't no twink. He's a tough guy. Oh shit. So they're gonna do some so WWE gonna... interlude here. Yeah. Here I'm fine with that. To our laws. We must settle all According to our you laws, you must settle contest. things in a ridiculous con. Hey, it really is Wakanda. Yeah. Shall be none other than Gorgo, our fiercest warrior. Gorgo. Huh? Gorgo. I think a fat bitch is coming. <laughs> no. I could beat her with my eyes closed. <laughs> <laughs> Gorgo, come on down. Taking candy from the baby. You name it. Gorgo. Stalker. I could beat her with my eyes. Why is she smiling? Isn't this supposed to be a serious situation? Whatever. Yep. Whoa. Yeah, they have a fat bitch in a cage. I knew it. Fat bitch in a cage. You don't have a name like Gorgo and look like a normal chick. Gorgo. Rah! Holy shit, that is a monster. He's fucked. Look at it, look at the size of her. She's like you sized. Damn, dude. <laughs> it's TJ. <laughs> it's, it's TJ in a red wig. <laughs> Alright, I this is why I didn't want to watch this because uh, Oh god, dude, TJ, you're in this? <laughs> oh, someone gave us 15 bucks. Check out the made for TV Ewoks movies, Caravan of Courage and Battle for Endor, both on YouTube. I've seen one of those. I don't remember which one. That's a nice outfit. They are terrible. You to, uh, buy your at a Thank you store. for the uh, generous contribution to whatever the fuck we're doing here. <laughs> it's CJ in a wig, dude. I can't believe it. <coughs> oh God. You got to admit I'm a better actress. Than oh, you're wait you're the best thing in this movie so far. So, congrats on that. Yeah, whoop, rip him apart, Gorgo. He sucks. Somehow this fucking, like, dude that lives on the road 
finds time to feather his fucking hair every morning, so fuck him. Not to mention, him. does he have a fucking, like, a uh, bow flex or some shit? I mean, what the fuck is going on? Yeah, I don't know. He finds time to be clean-shaven with feathered hair and a perfectly defined body. So, whatever. All right, round one goes to me. Yeah, dude. Seven, it kind of looks like Big Red, too. Longer with Big Red. I'm choke slamming here, fuck face. Come on, come on, come on. Whoop his ass, yeah. That's what I'm talking about, Gorgo. Eating tons of popcorn for this den of pigs. Eat it, you nasty man. Okay. Thanks for the four dollars. Okay, come on. Wow, why do they have like wrestling in this Amazonian society? I don't know. Vince McMahon got there first, I guess. <laughs> Someone give $50 and see if TJ will dress like that. If you send me that outfit and $50, then yes. I'll recreate this scene. Dude, she whooped his ass. Well, yeah. She's dominant. Have the strength. I got the stamina. Go get him. So, I mean, like, it's just devolved into total comedy at this point. Like, the yeah. movie, this is the point where even the movie's like, all right, we know you're not taking this seriously. Yeah. Either we check it out. Here's some slapstick. Rah! Where did they get these fucking... I don't know, dude. I this mean, is a lot of wrestling, though. Yeah, I mean, like, like they were. Th this is not just a throwaway joke. This is like they're this, dedicating some time to this. Yeah, this is, a, this is a whole arc in the film, the whole wrestling arc. And they got placards and shit. Yeah, there's ten rounds of this shit so far. It's still not over, either. Why has he got more energy in the tenth round? Because he's starting, you know, uh, he's, he's his, rising uh, to the occasion against this opponent. You know, she's bringing out the best in him. Got it. Gorgo is his, like, the dark mirror, you know what I mean? That he wow, has there's fi fi round 15, huh? Jesus. Like, at what? At some point, does it just go to, like, some judges or something? I think it just goes until one of them just can't go anymore, dude. That is the way. That is the way, TJ. <laughs> Do you know the way? Do you know the way? <laughs> Oh my god, kill me. <laughs> Alright, can someone like just win this contest? Like this scene is overstaying its welcome at this point. Just letting you know, movie. Alright, so for 15 rounds they're even the match, but now he's just fucking her up. Xenodroid in the chat says Gorgo versus Ivan Drago. That'd be awesome. Yeah, dude. She just ripped this little faggot's head off, and then Ivan Drago came out. And then we'd have a real fight. Boo, says the women's. Damn. It's very rare in a movie to see a dude just straight up repeatedly punching a chick in the face. Kill her! Kill her! Kill her! What are you doing? What are you doing? Kill her! No. Want to kill her? Even though I've, you've seen me brutally slitting men's throats and blowing up midgets, I'm above killing. Ah, this man knows the way. That was incredible. See, was he's gonna great. he's gonna impress them with his mercy. Wait. Look, I know I haven't been completely on the level with you. Yeah, you can say that again. I can't believe I bought that whole bill of goods you tried to sell me. I bet you're not even a seer. Well, not a very good one. Not but a very a good one. Or I was. Like, for instance, I thought Just this movie would be a, a financial hit. 
It was not. I am not Gorgo. I am D Way. Okay. Look, I escaped. Thanks I for the one dollar, sir. Believe me. So you dangled fame and fortune in front of me like some kind of carrot? Didn't you think I might help you? Have you ever heard of honor among thieves? No, you because you clearly told her when she that. tried to get your help that you weren't gonna give it to her. So, that's bullshit. Look, begging your highness's pardon, but uh, like, I only save people once a day. Now go walk east until your head floats, bitch. Begging your highness's pardon, but I need to go blow dry my hair. <laughs> Excuse me, princess. You gone. All right, so now a domestic scene over at the villain's lair, I guess. Men's hairstyles really were problematic in the 80s. This mullet shit. TJ only lost the fight because of bad cardio. TJ wins the rematch. Look, everyone knows those wrestling matches are fixed. In real life, Gorgo obviously would have destroyed that bitch in like two rounds. Oh yeah, dude. She would have ripped his fucking head off and shit down his fucking throat, dude. It'd have been over. So, I mean, let's be real here. <laughs> Gorgo. Gorgo would have fucked that shit up. Did the rape start? Um, you've already missed a few. Yeah, there's been a couple. There's been, like, several rapes. I mean, I none explicit. Just, you know, Im implicit rapes. Implied rapes. Suggested rapes. Yeah. Now for the moment of triumph. Um, a work of art, don't you think? I duplicated him no. and I duplicated you. <clears throat> it looks like a couple of Puerto Rican dudes. Neat. Missing crucial plot development here, done. guys. Uh, Thank you. I'm pretty sure there's no such thing in this movie. <laughs> Whoa. It works. Is that Vadim Newquist? <laughs> did he clone? Did he clone Vadim, Vadim Newquist? What happened? Is the climax of this movie in an Applebee's? Thank you. Okay. I swear to God, if a talking cat saves the day, I'm fucking out, dude. That's what—that's <laughs> what's gonna be crossing the line. Yep, that's it. <laughs> Ain't there Death Shocker? Deathstalker got his throat slit by a robot in Chopping Mall. Dude, I love Chopping Mall. Oh, that's... Oh, the dude that plays Deathstalker? Cool. I guess. That's a nice little piece of trivia. Chopping Mall is brilliant. I'm sorry, I, I really don't know what's going on. I was too busy doing what I was supposed to do with that footage. <laughs> You're too busy thinking of Chopping Mall. I was ogling it. Damn! Wow, Deathstalker. Wow. Remember, you monogamously promised to only be with the princess. Oh, wait, that never happened, so never mind. Go ahead. Whoa, dude. So the head fucking Amazon bitch is now just like... Yep. Yep. Gur, well... She she didn't even make a sound. They forget the sound effect there. <laughs> Maybe whatever stupid Twice. try she made was Desire so bad they just cut it and went with the loot. You have it. I like that. I mean, man. she broke the thing. I mean, all you they had to do was first, throw in a. Psh. Eyes on you. I thought you'd be just another barbarian. All muscle. Way you mind. beat the shit out of that well, fucking so woman made me think I was wrong. Mom was a bricklayer. I guess I got the best of both. <laughs> All right. Shall we drink then? Deathstalker, do me a favor uh, and just don't speak. Yeah, dude. And the magnificent battle. You still maintain that. To come. He's got charisma argument, or uh, you want to go ahead and? Uh, I mean, <clears throat> when it comes to like the levels uh, to which some of these B movie protagonists descend, he's not that bad. Not that All right, I, I, I guess I can see that. Because sometimes you get just a lump of Forget fucking you. vanilla horse shit that is absolutely has no character at all. At least he tries, you know. He's like community so, theater level actory. Just wait here. But at least he's trying. 
Yeah, I'll give him that. And don't go away. He's giving it a little bit. He's giving it almost a shot. I bet it's poison. Stalker? Huh? Just think. Together we could rule as far as the eyes can see. That sounds good. Let's roll. Our loins could be masters of this kingdom for a hundred. Right now, my eyes can't no. see very well because of that stupid curtain. So can you pull that back? Death Stalker would make a better. Oh, sorry. There's a paid comment that came in. Death Stalker isn't being true to his heart. It's obvious that Gorgo is his true love. Yeah. Damn, dude. That would be a cool twist. Death Stalker falls in love with Gorgo. Death Stalker just starts fucking her in the middle of the ring. So wait a minute. Earlier we had titties bobbling around in our faces. Once like, again, this dude, bitch is main character. She's main too character, holy dude. for us yeah. to see her titties. Come on. If any woman that you're supposed to take seriously in the movie, you, can't you see don't get to see the titties. Oh. Well, you can kind of see them there. Yeah. You're allowed to see them through a veil because she's not a super main. Right. Well, you might see that, you know, on the red carpet or some shit. Yeah, you know. Thanks. I mean, that's that's acceptable. I mean, who knows? The rules of this movie are kind of inconsistent. Yeah, we'll see. Knows. So this... <laughs> All right. You got caught in a trap. Surprising. What a bumbling idiot. <laughs> All right. Now stick a spear in her. A trap set by a bunch of fucking dwarf assassins. Shh. No, I didn't think so. Okay. Well, that was terrible. They're gonna boil her? Maybe. I think this is something else. No, I guess it's not. Yeah, they're gonna boil her. Cool. Ah, now I'm just getting my dick ready for that. <laughs> there are matters we need to discuss. You! You're the one who helped Jared! In all the excitement, we never really did have a chance to sit down and talk. But now well, you're not we sitting down. all that. Where's Deathstalker? Why should I tell you anything? Huh. I can think of lots of Cause reasons. I'm gonna boil you, bitch. Yeah, do you I not mean, like, get the implication? You, I mean, it's right. I mean, what the fuck do you think is gonna? What do you think? What do you think is the setup there? And do you know why? Jarek needs to keep me alive to help himself. Let's dangle her over a pit of boiling and liquid. Of you, most of Tell us what we want to know you or what? <laughs> it's like, <laughs> what do you yes. think, you do moron? You know I could drop you, say, up to your waist, fuck. and you'd still be very much alive. However, your capacity to enjoy some of life's more sensual pleasures would be diminished greatly, little one. Now, little princess. So she just threatened to boil her pussy. Yes. <laughs> I don't know. Perhaps you misunderstood. Finally. Question, but I will give you the benefit of the doubt because that is the kind of woman I am. Oh man. And the and the, the next one was rated PG-13. Okay. And you will tell me now. They really fell now, from uh, from Grace there. <laughs> Somebody looking for me. Stalker! You came back. Oh. My popular demand. Get him! I'm kind of confused as to where this place is <laughs> geographically compared to where they were before. <laughs> I'm gonna boil your pussy. <laughs> <laughs> tell me where Death Stalker is, or I'll boil up that pussy good. <laughs> there he is, right there. Oh shit. <laughs> oh man, this movie's breaking my t shirt. <laughs> <laughs> I'm starting to get the fear, man. <laughs> oh, it's sitting in. Oh man. <laughs> I'm all for it, of course. <laughs> I like when Paul breaks. <laughs> the ridiculousness of this shit is just too much. <laughs> I'm gonna boil your pussy and nobody will ever want to fuck a boiled pussy. Oh, man. Oh, no. Why is he going to have this happen? Stop it, Paul. Your insanity is contagious, dude. No. Don't do it. Don't do it. Don't do it. No, 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 man. No, I ain't going down this path with you. I ain't going down this path, dude. <laughs> I'm just gonna straight up. I just need to... <laughs> oh, man. What the fuck is wrong with the world? <laughs> um. Oh, we never got to see her tits. Nah, no, she's dead. Stop!
It's like they didn't even slow that down. They just had her do it slow. No need to worry, Paul, because I'm just wild about Harry, and Harry's wild about me. For five dollars. Oh, man. Oh. It's subsiding. I don't know, man. I just caught a case of the... <laughs> what the fuck? I'm sorry. I oh. almost got my pussy boiled just now. <laughs> <laughs> Maybe you should make use of it before some villain does boil it for real. It really made me value my pussy more. Knowing it could be boiled at any time. Period through the mouth. What? Oh, because she... Yeah, okay. That's pretty corny. Get her Holy shit. Once, fools. Will there be anything else, my lord? Out. Out. <laughs> Next movie, Gargoyles, 1972. It's on YouTube. Okay. Hey, Paul, you want some boiled clams? <laughs> <laughs> Dude. That's what they should have called this. <laughs> Fuck that stalker, man. <laughs> oh, pussy boiler. Pussy boiler 2. <laughs> Can we get like a saw, like, you know, the ongoing over the top adventures. violence uh, movie <laughs> in that vein? <laughs> he just boils <laughs> chicks' pussies. I didn't know they had strobe lights in these days. I guess they did. <laughs> That's used by taking a refractive crystal. Whoa, strobe light titties. Whoa, 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 whoa. This titties giving me epilepsy, <laughs> dog. Why was she so pissed at those titties? Cause, uh, she looks so mad. No, because that guy was fucking that brunette bitch, and she wants to fuck him for herself, for whatever, oh. etc. Oh, okay. I thought she was just angry at the dance. Yeah, she's just like, ah, fucking strobe light titties. Ah, oh, god damn it. I'd like to boil her pussy right about now. <laughs> oh, man. This movie is so stupid. <laughs> no, it's not. You just don't understand its genius. Oh, Love these 80s cheese fest boiling Very cheese. <laughs> boiling is cheese? Is cheese slang for pussy wherever you're from? <laughs> so you, are you Australian or something? Get a piece of your cheddar! <laughs> it's like, I don't know. Gargoyles is actually Where pretty good. Let's go. Alright. Under the castle. What was that? A the person wind. screaming. <sighs> Probably somebody's pussy getting boiled. <laughs> a lot of pussy <laughs> boilers around. <laughs> yeah, well, if he did, you didn't have a chance to tell it. <laughs> don't say it. Just don't say it. But every time you have a vision, something bad happens. Stop Steamed get out. tuna. Just get out of here. <laughs> Hi, guys. <laughs> Quit breaking oh, Paul, dude. Stalker. You need to come through the servant's entrance. I would have welcomed you through the front gates. Oh, I, I've seen your welcoming committee. You know, despite your rather silly name, I hear you're quite an extraordinary swordsman. <laughs> another time. Oh, God. I've forgotten. There won't be another time. You see, I couldn't possibly... Oh, this fucking movie is so stupid. <laughs> Kill him. Stop! That guy's face kind of looks like He's a boiled mine. pussy to me now. I thought you was dead. Not. Say you're looking better than ever, and it's uh, really great to be back here. Oh, man. Okay. All right, all right, all right. Yeah, that's right. I gotta pull myself together. I have a show to do. Poor girl fell off her hole. What can we do? Check her heart. <laughs> Whoa! Sweet! <laughs> I, just, I came out of it just in time. <laughs> Here's the third rape scene in this movie. And you never saw her tits up until now either. So they're like, we want to show her tits for the first time in the context of, like, an attempted rape. Yeah. 
Rape tits. That's when you finally get to see her titties. When some ruffian just fulfills your wishes and rips her fucking shirt right off her chest. <laughs> this movie is problematic AF. Um, whoa. Who's that? <laughs> Don't what? you think we should... Ow! Do something? I mean, Stalker... Would you cut that out? You'd be in real trouble by now. So the joke here is that... Oh, calm yourself, child. One what of them has a good mind? masseuse and the other one Enjoy. has a shitty masseuse? I think no, so. Man, so. Okay. Batman is worth such an amount of a woman... Back before husband. people were against rape. Yeah. I mean, it was a more innocent what? time. You could oh, blow up yes, a midget. Yes, <laughs> you yeah. could depict you brutal rape in a movie. I mean, child. you know... Just did what you wanted back in them times. Boil somebody's pussy. <laughs> yeah, you boil their pussy up, you know? I've lost the plot. Well, um, I don't really think you're... Let me, let me fill you in. Uh, titties, titties, let's boil her pussy, titties, titties, titties. That's it. Did you know that these girls are trained from birth in the mystical arts of body rubbing? Body rubbing, also known as massage. I don't want my tension drain. I want to get out of here. Shadow is not cast, but born of fire. And the brighter the flame, the deeper the shadow. Here's two washies. Hope you like them. Thank you. Thanks. All right. Well, that was a completely pointless scene. Yep. Thank you, Deathstalker. <sighs> okay. Well. All right. I got a cigarette with my name on it, dude. It's calling me. Good evening, Deathstalker. There's a cigarette calling me. Are you tired of watching princess? Deathstalker 2? Got a cigarette waiting for you. <laughs> and I'm sorry to see you go. We could have made a great team. You should turn that into your catchphrase, time, Paul. Whenever you're upset about something, just be like, well, that really boils my pussy. <laughs> Did you ever think about joining our side? You know what really boils my That just pussy? steams my clam, guys. <laughs> I'll be honest with you. I'm sure it buys a lot of nice things, but can't buy Oh, man. Happiness. Is the first Death Stalker good? I'm going to predict no. Whatever makes you sore. It's probably pretend. not. Goodbye, Death Stalker. The second one that we're watching is obviously awesome, it. but Death Stalker 2, I'm sure, is dog shit. Mother. I'm surprised it's not on his dick. Oh, the Gamorian guards are back. I forgot there was pig people in this movie. Yeah. They went a little too long without showing the pig people. Most of my gentlemen callers bring flowers. Damn, my mistake. I was giving them the wrong princess. I don't want to shock you, but uh, there's another girl running around here that's a dead ringer for you. That little harlot is nothing but a lying imposter. <laughs> that's funny, because that's exactly what she said about you. Uh, say, would you mind uh, calling Why didn't they just make here? a softcore porn? I mean, they got pretty close. Big laughs, these guys. Let's be real. Next time I see him, it's gonna be on a plate next to some eggs. Don't you think I look like a prince? The Death Stalker is actually pretty great. Actually, is, wait, like is great actually? It's full of you constant like rape. Princess. Our audience has interesting standards for yeah, they for like, film. <laughs> they really, they like rape. I think like that's what I'm getting. They like the rape, and they like the pussy boiling, Sh and they like I'm when you lose your shit. Mm. Oh. And how's the princess supposed to act? I'm not sure. Man I, uh, bear pig. This definitely is the rapiest movie I've seen in a long time. Brett is in the movie as the pig men. Which one? Oh, I could just eat you alive. Bones and everything. And she will. We've seen her do yeah. it. Well, she did it off screen. Start with this yeah. bone, baby. Damn, his vest came off quick. Yeah, it just disintegrated. It was like... <laughs> That's cool. <laughs> this is the titty-sucking scene I was talking about. Oh, man. We missed several very, very, very prominent titty scenes. 
What are you talking about? There's no tits. Oh shit, there is. I guess there are some tits in this movie, Paul. <laughs> oh no. I'm just noticing that. But at least we're getting to see the main character's tits, albeit... I think we're gonna have to just like, put this on private and maybe do some, uh, some editing. Yeah. Cause this is like, pretty gratuitous with this. Yeah, there's a lot of titties here. There's a, there's a... <laughs> you guys seeing this live get to experience the titties. You people watching the edited version. Yeah, maybe you'll get to see, you know, a little bit of titty, but... Yeah, we'll leave the veiled up titties for you. Cause, <laughs> holy shit, man, this is a lot of titty. Ad friendly content. <laughs> Cinema for Cynics, a family show. Jeez, man. Uh. Did somebody fart? He looks like he smelled a fart. Mind stalker. Uh. What? Kacha! Whoa. Dun -dun 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 -dun. I thought I told you not to hang around with girls like that. <laughs> it was just her looks that got to me. Oh, well, in that case. Uh, look, I don't want to sound. Oh, you fucked my evil but... clone. I'm cool with that. How the hell did you get in here? You're forgetting one thing. I mean, you know. This is my castle, my room, my bed for crying out loud. And you think I don't know where the secret passageways are? Well, uh. Thanks. Okay. Thought you might need this. <laughs> I imagine a legitimately good movie wouldn't provide much comp comedic fodder for you guys, but would you two ever consider doing a cinemax versus cinema of a film people consider arguably Besides, I got a surprise for you. Oh, sorry. Here we are. Uh, arguably the best such as Citizen Kane is what he said. Um I mean, I don't think we could do one of these about Citizen Kane, but maybe there's a movie that How people like that we don't like that we could take a look at for like Patreon yep. or something. That's how they say it, all right. You can't possibly kill us all. One against 100. Make that two against 100. Kill them. You don't really bring much to the table. Hey! What about we even up those odds considerably? I don't know. What about you do that, I guess? Whoa. So this castle was totally invaded and surrounded by an opposing yeah. force with no one noticing? Okay. What a completely non-functional castle. And the whole point of a castle that this can't happen to you? <laughs> yeah, like... Okay, whatever. There, I guess they were all distracted. Yeah, there, there, are, there are a lot of hot bitches, so... Yeah, I mean, it's pretty easy to get distracted in this world. A lot of titties, boiled pussy. <laughs> Delicious. Pussy boiler <laughs> to the revenge. <laughs> the local delicacy, dude. Poached pussy. Excuse me, waiter. This pussy is a little chewy. Could you uh, throw it back into the boiler for a moment? <laughs> All right. So here's the big, impressive, climactic end battle scene. <laughs> um. So you know when Arnold did Conan? Oh wow. That. Whoa. That was just wow. I mean, like, there was zero force behind that. I am embarrassed for everyone else in this movie that they had to be in a movie that featured that fucking scene. I mean, that like, was a joke. Can you imagine beyond. being one fucking of those guys? Like, joke. and then she's gonna spin the staff at you, and then she just kind of like eh, taps you with it, and you gotta be like, oh, it's the sheer ineptitude. I am defeated by that, I guess. That was remarkable. Where are you going? When Arnold did Conan, he like studied sword life. play for like six months man. beforehand. John Milius, the director, Relax insisted on it. Get out of my I don't. Way. I, I don't think any of these people touched their sword props before they were handed to him before the scene. Like, all right, so just kind of 
you know, no, swinging around. I have a splitting headache. I'm trying to get some sleep. You. Inside, inside. It's not over yet. You okay? Okay. Yes, you are. Come on, we got business to All right. To. I'm, I'm... She knocked out a ninja? How eh. you let this happen? You've ruined my life. I gave you your life. Now go to your chambers. I'll be there shortly. Go. Go. That is if Deathstalker doesn't best me in a sword battle. That guy's not wearing a protective suit or anything. One of the extras literally caught fire and they just filmed it and kept it in. Hello, you beautiful turkey-headed golems. Okay. Wow. Guys, just upload this to D DTube. Make more money. Leave the good stuff. Well, we could just we can upload a version to DTube as well. Yeah. I'll figure out how this is gonna be released. Throne yeah, five. we're gonna, we'll have to we'll have to figure it out. There's only room for one princess in this castle. What are you gonna do? Can't tell you. Girl talk. Girl talk. I am telling you though, dude. I ain't telling you, but I'm gonna stab her. <laughs> so wait a minute. You're literally gonna send the princess off to kill her clone? She's... And just trust that whichever one comes back is the real one? Okay. Yeah. That, that always works out. I don't know what's sadder, the fact that this movie is using that stupid trope, or the fact that conventional mainstream blockbusters like Alien Covenant still use this yeah. fucking terrible goddamn trope. Great. Wow. <sighs> yeah, if you think you're building suspense here, guess what? Nah. Just you can just get right to the part where they're fighting. Yep. We're just supposed to wait in your chambers anyway, bitch. Whatever. Down, down. <laughs> Are you scoring a movie or trying to communicate with an alien race? You bitch. Right. Wow. She is defeated. At least they're not doing the fucking the evil bitch comes back disguised as her and tricks Deathstalker routine. Yeah. But he set himself up for it, so he's still a retard. Whoa, that. Wow. Okay. Okay, movie. Hey. Whoa. Calm down. Okay. Wow. All right. All right. All right. Whoa. Hey. S settle down, editor. Settle down. Has more jump cuts. You cutting him. between the same shitty three scenes really fast yeah. doesn't make them more epic, believe it or not. This makes it more like a, an Onesian vlog. Just calm the fuck down, please. Jump cut. 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 Still ready for that the sooner one of you is dead, the sooner this Spoken movie's like over, so line. let's make it happen. But not a living one. Uh it's a western now, I guess. Alright, now it's not anymore. Oh, great, man. Cool. This is pretty cool. Hey, after this, do you want to go ride the, uh, <laughs> the dueling dragons? <laughs> Why am I you know shorter? I don't like roller coasters. This is about as thrilling as I let myself get watching this show. All right, right yeah. then let's just go to the smoking section after this is over, then. Now, see, there's an idea I like. Yeah, we'll just I mean, honestly, there. it does seem like they did try maybe to choreograph this a little more, but it's still really bad. It's just, like, I... But, like, compared to every other sword fight in this movie, it does seem like they tried marginally yeah. harder to make it something. But once again, it looks like something I'd see yeah. at, you know, Six Flags Magic Mountain or some shit, the stunt show. Yep. It does. Young Conan or some shit. It's even scored that way. Like, this is the music they'd be playing at that, too. Oh, 
Like this is the this is the music that would be playing in the waiting room lobby before the show started. They lifted it right out of this, dude. Come on. He's really good at flipping things over. Yeah, he likes to just destroy like. Yeah, like it, his rule is like if you can't fight your enemy, just flip tables over and shit. Dude, maybe that's like some subtext about his character. Like I'm in good shape, so I destroy where people eat. That's his way to of like. To shame them. Yeah. Well, no, that's that's his way of just like saying like if you want to look like this, you better stop eating. Maybe it's like, you know, a little. Little Sub message. Yeah, a little message in this Subliminal. movie. Subliminal. It's sad that someone greenlit this movie, and yet Please Clap will likely never be. I know, right? Well, Please Clap didn't have enough titties in it, dude. Dude, how many... Dude, there'd be tons of titties in Please Clap. TJ, please keep making triggered videos. Paul, just watch your vids. Vid on movies you never would rewatch. Want to know your thoughts on Sinec... Sinec... I can't pronounce that. Yeah. New York. Love your stuff, guys. Uh, I like the movie. Uh, it's not... I don't know. It's not one of those ones that's too hard for me to rewatch. I'd rewatch it. Whoa. Whoa! Damn! Dude. He poked that guy right in the neck. You don't want to see a fucking modern-day remake of this. Why? Because there's so much fucking potential, dude. What? Yeah. In a Conan ripoff? Yeah, dude. There was boiling pussies. There was titties. There was weird rape bars. I mean, like, a lot of the coolest stuff isn't even explored in depth, dude. There's nothing cool going on in this movie. We could remake it. Oh, so wait a minute. We're supposed to... This is, they won! This is supposed to be us out there in the audience. Like, yay, Deathstalker Yay, Deathstalker did it. Yay. Yeah. So this is that moment in the movie? Yeah. It's like the bow at the end of the fucking... It really is. Somebody filmed a fucking... <laughs> But wait, there's got to be one last, like... No? Mm -hmm. Wow, just sun... kept cheering all day, the dude. The sun came up. Oh, okay. Uh, is that Deathstalker up there doing uh, flips? No, dude. Whoa. Wow. Queen Bikini. Bikini. <laughs> Prepare my Bikini. <laughs> I go to the throne. <laughs> my Bikini. Whoa, Gorgo's there, dude. Yeah, Gorgo. Sweet. Gorgo's right? like, good job, Deathstalker. Yeah, Come forward, Deathstalker. Execute him. <laughs> Yeah. Feed him to Gorgo. <laughs> Boil his pussy. We've searched through the kingdom's coffers for some expression of our appreciation for your magnificent deeds. And that is? You're looking at it, Bucko. <laughs> You're looking right at it, Bucko? No, let me Sweet. Ball. Uh, you won't be needing this anymore. So you really think our story is going to make it into the legends? Oh, more than that. A thousand years from now, right. players will reenact all our exploits. Really? Players? Well, is this was like, this supposed to be a video game? A like Ice T play players, or like <laughs> <laughs> what are we talking about? I think they mean actors. Oh, okay. They're saying that they're light. Okay, it's over. The end. All right then. Uh, oh, okay. You sucked. John Turkoleski. You sucked. You sucked the worst. Yeah, you were the worst. Uh, how you, you must have sucked a lot of dicks to get that role, because, man, you had no talent. John Lazar, eh, whatever. Yeah, you were a pretty mediocre B-movie villain. Yeah. You, you <laughs> Tony Nipples, you were, uh, you were a thing, I guess. Maria, suck us your cock. 
Wow, TJ, what a misogynistic joke. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Marcos Walensky, don't remember you. Oh, yeah, who are you? Big Red. Queen Kong. Sick. Hell yes. Yeah, you're awesome. Definitely. She was definitely a pro wrestler by trade. And then these unreadable people. People weren't too eager to have their name in these credits, I feel like. <laughs> Wow. So, outtakes. Cool. So that was the best outtake. She drinks it and coughs. Dude, I wish, um... I wish Schindler's List had been followed <laughs> by a bunch of outtakes. Yeah, of dude. <laughs> like the Jews tripping and getting up and going, Oh, shit, man! They shoot him and he doesn't fall. Like, what? Yeah. <laughs> what? What? It was my turn? Oh, man. Shit. Oh, shit. She can't shoot an arrow. Why, why do they feel the need to show us this? Can we just end? Like, I just want to spend a little longer in the richly developed world of Death Stalker. Stalker! I leave him out for five minutes. Look what happened. Ow! God damn it, that's hot! Ha! <laughs> so he burned himself? He burned his fucking hand, dude. What a pussy ass little bitch. Wow. He couldn't even fucking take the slightest pussy boiling, dude. Don't you dude. think I look like a princess? You dress like a princess. Is she gonna fall? Please tell me she falls on her face. Excuse me. What? She walked down the stairs badly, and then she got pissed. <laughs> I'm pissed. It makes me, it, it kind of just, like, the way she reacted to that makes me think that I was on to something when I said she just is kind of evil in real life. She's like, fucking stairs. Excuse me. I just got here, so I missed the film, but fuck it, take my money. Oh, well, thank you. Aw. You're too kind. That's lunch, 30 minutes. Ha. <laughs> She was not thrilled with that. Yeah, she was giving a riveting, porn-worthy performance. Huh? Come on. Huh? Please. Let us go. Enough. Jeez. Deathstalker 2, come on. It's these fucking... All right. Wow, some extra titty. Shit, they're laughing. They're terrible. Death Stalker 2. La da 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 da. Wow. Dude, when we uh, selected our movies, no, no, thank you. No, 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 no. No. No Death Stalker 3. Oh, <laughs> wow. Dude, Ooh, um, you know what, TJ? Yeah. What's Let's just that? do it, dude. What? No, I'm kidding. Dude. I'm kidding. Because I was like, I don't want to do that, dude. I really don't. Uh, what the fuck is this? Hundra? Hundra, warrior queen. I'm just going to take a little peek at that. Yeah, yeah. Hundra, the warrior queen. What the fuck is this? Wow. Worse than Death Stalker. It looks level. worse than Death Stalker. Alright. That was just to sate my curiosity, I guess. Well, there we go. Um So Death Stalker <sighs> two. Um we're gonna have to edit this, I guess, so Yeah, throw up some noops. Whatever. Um We'll see you faggots in um, eternity. I don't know. We're going to fucking put... Um, in eternity? Yeah, I don't know. My mind is broken. What do you want <laughs> yeah, from me? Yeah, dude, I, I, I have nothing. I, I have don't nothing. know, dude. I'm just... I'm fucking spent on that. This uh, movie really boiled my pussy, man. Yeah, dude. It boiled your pussy up <laughs> real good. <laughs> oh, man. That pussy is fucking... That pussy is boiled, dude. All right. Fuck you guys. Uh, hope you enjoyed. We'll put an uncensored version of this somewhere and a censored version up on YouTube and um, 
rock on. Yeah.